hello everyone so today we are going to work on this as you can see here over there in the chest uh, when I go within a certain distance a dot appears above the chest to show that it is uh, interactable and if I go here I get the press uh, E to open and if I open it both dot and the widget disappears like that item is collected and the same way the dots appears for all the chests in the world so yeah this is what we are going to work on today if i go closer uh, further dot disappears in the here i get the prompt to open if i move away prompt disappears and if i move further away dot also disappears so this is what we are going to work on and before we get started let me remind you that you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that i have done from my patreon page to the date there are over 2000 videos and for each video project files are available here and also this is a part of this section rpg with game playability system series you can watch all these episodes as well I'll leave the link to the full playlist in the description all right now let's get back to today's tutorial right so I have created this texture first in uh, Photoshop and I have imported it into my project like this so it's just a transparent PNG with the white dot in the middle so uh, now here is my chest if I open the blueprint now you may have noticed that I have made slight changes to the some slight change to this collider to allow colliding easily with the player and also made this lead and the collider as a child of the chest so uh, right now I'll add a billboard here and there are two types of billboards just the regular billboard and material billboard if I add regular billboard you can here use the texture but or if you add a material billboard you have some additional options here if you add a sprite you can see this uh, distance to size curve and distance to opacity curve so we can use this to make this uh, dot disappear when I'm beyond a certain distance and appear when I'm within certain distance to the chest so therefore I'm going to use this material billboard I'll make it a child of chest and place it in a location like this yeah that's better okay now uh, all I need is to show this dot so let's create a material M interact dot Here, the material domain should be user interface. I'll connect final color like this and alpha. Oh, alpha is not there because the blend mode is opaque. I'll make it translucent and add like this. Now I can use this uh, interactive material here and it appears like this so this is too large maybe 8 by 8 is big enough right now here if I play the game you can see the dot here mm. maybe it would be better if it is a bit bigger by 
by 16. Let's see. Yeah, that's more clear. Okay. Okay. Now the next thing I want to do is when I go close here, this uh, dot should disappear. Oh wait. Before that, let's set the curves. So here, distance to opacity curve. Let's. Oh, we don't have a curve for that. Mm -hmm. Maybe let's create a curve here. We can use the curve to define what's the distance that it should appear and disappear. We'll put curve. Billboard okay. and open it. Let's add a key, maybe at zero scale uh, value is one, and another key at uh, one thousand distance. Also, value is one. Wait. I add it. Yeah. We got two keys now here. Okay, and another key. At one thousand and ten value is zero. Like that. Right. Now, now uh, let's assign this to this distance. Go billboard. Okay. Now let's see. It's not visible now. If I go close, see, it appears. Disappears and appears. Okay, cool. Now the next step is when I go, when I uh, overlap with this collider, this dot should appear, and I need to show a tip in a widget. Press uh, like E to open, something like that. So for that, here. Yeah. Let's create a widget. Use an interface widget. Use an universal widget. WTG. Interact. Yeah, that should be good. Enough. That's the name. Okay, now here, uh, uh, what should we? Let me add a uh, canvas banner, and then under that, I'll add a text. Okay, let's no, not a text first. Let's add a border and I'll make it center. And set the alignment to center like this. Okay, now let's make this black with a bit of uh, transparency oh sorry 
right now under here let me add a text okay I'll set the size to content this is too big I'll make it light and maybe 11 right now here open and I need to show the key but key should have some highlight apart uh, compared to this uh, text so maybe let's wrap this with the uh, horizontal box and then duplicate the text first text E press E to open okay maybe let's add some spacing now for this let's add a background by wrapping this with another border okay now this is not visible so let's make it black so it's visible and also let's make this bold this is eleven right now they are properly aligned okay now this is the widget that I want to show when I go closer so what should we do this let's add a widget okay and as the widget WDG interactive and it should be visible in a screen space. Let's see how it looks. Yeah, that's how it looks. Okay, but I don't want it to be visible in the beginning, only when I go here. So Here yeah, I have this by default. I'll make it hidden in game and then when I go closer, set hidden in game to false when the character overlaps with the widget. And at this time, um, billboard should be set should be hidden so it should be hidden like this right and when the character leaves means here it should be again hidden billboard should be again visible and here when the when the item is collected I'll set both I'll remove the visibility of uh, everything so set visibility to false and propagate children okay now let's see right now by default we don't have the dot if I go closer we get the dot and if I go more closer we get the E and if I collect the dot and everything disappears cool let's see here okay I got the dot collect got the dot collect okay cool so yeah great and that's all i want to cover in this episode so yeah thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe maybe next time we should work on uh, shoes for the character we have now worked on helmets weapons shields and armor so we need to work on shoes and gauntlets as well 
so yeah see you in the next episode goodbye